with the foundation, dog, what we want to do is build with all culture thinking and all people that's thinking high level thinkers for the culture. Because what we want to do, Ace, we want to create something that we can go. This is hip hop, hip hop culture. Hip hop creation. Hip hop culture. 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 Uh, a banking system or anything big to us, we can say, we're not just looking for everybody else always using this, you know what I'm saying? Like, say, like, they have all the, all the resources and everything. Some other people come and, and go, you know what? Take everything that's theirs and give them little crumbs from what's theirs. Right. You know what I'm saying? So you like, yeah, are that's you been serious? happening for centuries. I mean, it's, it's basically, you know, selling back your own culture. And you know, European, you know. You know? You know? You know? I mean, it's so bad that we can't even speak about it openly. You know what I'm saying? And so, we know all these things, and, and we just, look, continue on the right path of what you're doing, and eventually, you know, you'll get aligned with the right brother. You know what I'm saying? You already sent me a box, I already wore it on one show. I'm letting people know Squan the MC. And, and other people, you know, will, will come. There are those who want to hold you back, right? While right. saying they are applauding you. You know what I'm saying? And that's difficult. It's a parameter of technology to that. And so you have to be able to sidestep, cut your lawn frequently, so you know where the snakes are. Uh -huh. And then just keep moving. Just keep moving. You know what I'm saying? And, and like I and like I normally say too, is like the only person that really has to believe is you. You know what I'm saying? Because as long as you sticking true to what yes. you is doing, Very true. other people can't come in and shake you off of what you're trying to do because you, have you already have a focal you. point. That's where your self-esteem is at. And that's the self, the same self-esteem. Those kind of people try to break down. Oh, energy jackets. Energy shifters. Energy shifters. And, you know, I'm just really trying to get you off your game in the name of anything they can come up with anything. at the moment. Anything. You know what I'm it saying? It could be the smallest. It could be about a taco. <laughs> it could be about a diaper, a dirty diaper. But as long as it can get you. As long as it can throw you and out. And you know who's the masters of that. And they're trying to Indeed. be like and they trying to be like something. They don't even know what time it is. Indeed. But us being the masters of who we are, being the master of self, you know, we understand where that is coming from. Mm -hmm. And so you want to stay away from that. You know, and if it's in your home, then sometimes you'll need an extra hour after work to yourself. You know, That's these real. things. So that you can continue on your path and what you got to do. And, and, and what you out here doing, the positive hip-hop, mm -hmm. conscious hip-hop, you know, positive hip-hop with a message. Mm -hmm. Giving it to the community. It's most definitely most important that you never let anybody veer you from the path you know is true and righteous. Even more so. Because they don't want us they don't they don't want this positive on radio. Because next thing you know you have a whole community of Carson, you know, of young kids with positive and vibrant ideas. Mm -hmm. And what they want to do is jack them for that and make them think that they're hoes, dope dealers, and just straight up niggas. Because it's easier to contain them. You can't contain a hundred strong children <laughs> with positive thinking and minds that want to change the world mm -hmm. in positive. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You see what it That's is? Real. So they'd rather have the young girl think she's just a hoe. And that way they can always be pointing at him and, and, and making him feel like, man, you know, we not good enough to really strive to be something better or well not not necessarily because that's a whole nother game okay see they'll do that to build themselves a, a pop culture trip okay at that point yeah where they can suck money back up off of it okay you see so now i get to look the young girl at eight years old tell her she's a hoe listen to this record listen to that lady gaga mm. fan, look at her look at how she dresses don't eat that don't touch this why are you looking like that why are you looking about all these things build that character right so then by the time she's 15 you're you have manipulated her you have enslaved her enough to your mind frame of thinking mm. that you can now put her on the scroll or on the stage okay make her sell some records and you get in the ducats off the comeback wow. see what it is see? see it's a violent cycle and, 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 and how do you how do you think that we say like real hip-hop that know what time it is yeah. say like we got the foundation where we, we want to build everybody that has the mind state to, to come in through from the culture and rearrange it, you know what I'm saying, whether it be, 
do music, building of the music, the education and everything, what do you think that we can do to get them to start picking up on the signs? Well, well, it starts it starts right here on the street level. From the street level, each one got to teach them. In other words, shared knowledge is the greatest weapon of all because they can't stop it. Right. Like, where's the government at here? <laughs> we, meanwhile, we're building skyscrapers mentally, right? Mm. So shared knowledge is the greatest weapon, my man Guru said on the first album, because they just can't stop it. You can't stop a build like this because now you're going to go to your walk of life and tell people what we spoke of. I'm going to go to my house and talk about what we talk about. Mm -hmm. and share that. You see what I'm saying? So once they can't stop that, and they can't, and we're out here teaching the seeds the right way, uh -huh. teaching the children. Mm -hmm. No, 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 no. It's not about that. It's right. not about Mickey Minaj and showing the game on the ground. Right. It's about how Queen Latifah presented herself right. back in the day. Right. Strong, positive black woman. Strong, positive Latino man. All these things. It's just about respecting the culture, respecting yourself, and everything that has it, to deal it, with it's you. It's a little bit trickier than that. It's a little bit trickier than that. Because now you're dealing with, you're dealing with psychological things. And, and manipulations of all types of things from the minute the child wakes up, from the minute they turn on the computer, the television set, or even walk outside, they're being manipulated um, with billboards, advertisements of all sorts. So, oh, yeah. So it's, it's now it has to start in the home. You dig? From the time the child is young, your, your, if your parents is right, they will teach you. But if your parents is too busy hustling and grinding, right. trying to make the rent, right. and they just turn the TV on for you to shut right. up, then we have an issue. Now it's governmental because now they done made it so hard for your dad to make the gas bill <laughs> that he ain't talking to mom. <laughs> Mom ain't talking to you because she mad at him. Right. So all these things. And it's in the structure of the very foundation of the family. Okay. You see what I'm saying? Okay. And could, so could hip hop be a way to kind of even that up in Well, it depends what kind of hip hop. We talk of consciousness, you know? We talk of music with a positive uh, message that uplifts the community, uplifts mm. what, you know, because it's lyrical food. Yeah. What you intake is what you're going to usually walk, right? Yep. It's the way you're going to walk. Yep. Um, and so when you hear popular radio, they're, what are they teaching you? What are they saying? What are the MC saying? Man. Meanwhile, if it's not on the radio, they think it's boring, stupid, and you're just not getting yours. Right. But we have to keep working and educating. Because that's what we are. We're street, street problems, okay. you know? Mm -hmm. And we have to keep educating the people, like right here at the Home Depot okay. Center. Right, right, doing, right. And everywhere we go. Everywhere and share knowledge and information. And let that weapon work. Let that weapon work. Because right now, there's a change, man. There's a change that people are asking for. And, and, and they don't even know it. They don't even know it. They're tired of the hostility. They're tired of the always wanting, never having. Right, right. They're tired of the negative. You can see it in the eyes of the community when you walk the streets. Yep. This, this yep. solemn look right. of defeat. People are waiting for that positive. Mm. That positive army of people to come through and just touch, bam. And once we to keep doing that, once we do that, we'll wake them up. We'll wake them we're up. We're waking them up already. That's why we're here. Yep. And that's what we're doing too with the foundation, man. We looking at it like we building with brothers like this and with everybody that's coming with the positive positivity of the culture, man. Like get the Zizix album. I man, I, I can't stress that enough, man. My man legendary Mellow Man Ace and Kazal, they just coming with heat, positivity for the youngsters. Because look, it's in the youngsters that we're gonna be able to show that this culture is strong. You know what I mean? And 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 that's what, that's what I love about my man, Mellow Man Ace. You know what I'm saying? Thank you, it's man. always love with us, with the foundation, man. And, and, and it can't happen without the kids understanding the culture. When you have a culture, what does the culture do? Whether it be um, the Native Indians or any tribe, when they, when they have their new, their youngsters, what do they, they, they pass the traditions down. You can't have a younger generation of a culture just going about representing the culture with no traditions passed down, no values, nothing like that. That's crazy. You know what I'm saying? It will never represent the culture. It's representing the rap part of it. 
right? But not the culture. See what I'm saying? The elements. You know what I'm saying? This is the culture. If, it, if you're not going to represent the culture and respect that and learn the tradition of the culture, then just go about it and don't be even part, don't even mention hip hop. You know what I'm saying? Because you're doing it more. May I interject on that? Mm -hmm. The thing is, we're not trying to tell people that having a gold chain is wrong. I had a gold chain every